so again just sit back relax and listen to the story of the evolution of magnesium from the starting till the ending so the main theme which runs through magnesium is rejection please remember rejection leading to repression this is the core of magnesium how the magnesium personality evolves from this particular mental state okay at early age or it could be even during i don't know young adult also the person might feel rejected the child feels rejected and abandonment abandoned by the parents okay the the young lady might feel rejected by or abandoned by or forsaken by her husband okay husband is not giving enough importance to her she could feel that loneliness or forsaken feeling okay that leading to repression repression and suppression there's a difference suppression he willfully pushes it down okay willfully he pushes the grief down repression he doesn't know okay it goes on its own it goes inside and comes out in the form of dreams okay dreams is a very important expression of the magnesium mind what type of dreams we'll deal with later so rejections begins as early as childhood or even gestational period where the mother and father have not given enough love for the child unwanted child unloved child especially during gestation we can think of magnesium okay even natrum natrum also can come so i told you this child might be an unwanted one which is rejection so just like iron magnesium also has a high melting point hence very high tolerance but here the tolerance is different okay than ferrum ferrum is more of rigidity more of uh, self i mean the will and the image is very important magnesium is peacemakers they want to have peace around them they want to have peace with other people okay so that is the difference between magnesium and ferrum so they have high tolerance level and threshold so both these combine and give strength to the magnesium character and a humane disposition that's why they are called mahatmas okay they are very humane people the lack of love rejection may be at any stage of life but the result is same which is repression so they tend to find positive ways to express the rejection okay a very simple example uh if me personally i have not been given enough love by my parents or my friends or whatever it hurts me deep inside but i try to sympathize with others and i try to help others so as to you know as a positive displacement of the sadness which i have gone through that is what magnesium does that's what even phosphorus does but phosphorus wants love in return okay so how is the positive way expressed by spreading love by creating peace by benevolence by social service okay so this is the expression of the magnesium mental state okay so that's why they are generally called the mahatmas okay this is just a general terminology they generally called the mahatmas so external serenity internal turmoil externally they appear very calm and composed and nice but inside they're boiling okay they're boiling they have a lot of suppression no, sorry they have a lot of repression so can says orphan remedy orphans remedy okay no i mean no mother or father or even abandonment at an early age so the rejection may be subjective as well the mother and father could be giving enough love but the child might feel forsaken that is her personal feeling okay so that is another area where magnesium can come this is due to the hypersensitive nature they are very hypersensitive that's why they keep thinking about this and they get more sensitized so tendency to push everything to the unconscious mind that's why it comes out in the form of dreams in the subconscious okay
So the internalized repression doesn't go away that easily. It builds like a volcano, kind of like a psychotic expression or a syphilitic expression. Syphilitic means if it destroys them from inside, you can think of syphilitic expression. But here, it keeps building, building, building like a volcano. Okay. And where is it expressed? It's expressed through dreams. Okay. This particular psyche, you should remember how the expression is. Okay. So expressed in the soma through anxiety, something bad will happen to the people he's close to. Okay. So that is one characteristic anxiety. Something bad will happen to the people he is close to. Okay. You can note that down. It's quite important. So they are modest, they are humble, they feign independence. Feigning is nothing but faking or false, okay? Feigning independence. They might think or they might tell other people that, no, I want to be alone, I'm independent, but actually they are dependent because they've never had that uh, maternal or the paternal love. They need someone for that love, okay? That's why it's called feigning independence. Feeling of loneliness, of being left behind, being abandoned in a railway station. So this is one particular dream, which I think comes in Magcarb or Magmure. I'm, I'm not particularly sure. We'll deal with it later. But what the dream says is the person, the magnesium patient is standing on the platform and he's witnessing his family members in the train. The train is starting to move. He's starting to run to catch the train, but he doesn't catch the train. Okay, eventually he wakes up. So this is how he's feeling rejected. He's being abandoned by his family and he's not able to catch them. Okay. So feeling of being betrayed or mortified, magmure is more important. Okay. So I just want you to look at this. Okay. Start from the top, hypersensitive. Okay. There are three reactions to that. Let's go for the left first. So hypersensitive magnesium gets hurt easily. They get depressed. There is, they get reserved and they become indolent. Okay. Next. In the right side, we see anxiety is another expression, which leads to insecurity and anticipation. Okay. But the main, main reaction we see is this demanding love and care. Okay. They don't get that love and care. That's why there's lack of love. Then, they push that love down. I mean, that they push that feeling yeah. down to a repression and that repression comes out in the form of dreams and delusions, okay? The lack of love also has another alternate reaction that is positivity in giving love and they can go for pacifism, okay? So you remember this particular slide, it's quite important. The whole psyche of magnesium can be understood through this slide. So lack of love, orphan, it could be real, where the parents, as you can see in the background in the left side, the parents are fighting and the child is like, I'm alone here, give me love, okay? And it could be apparent, okay? The parents are good with the child, but the child feels that, okay? Like female child, no? Usually female child, they are quite rejects, especially in the Indian culture. So they could feel that way, okay? Even though the mother and father is giving equal love to the child, if it's a female child, the child might feel that way. Okay, so you can see in the background, parents are fighting and the child listens to them and they, she cannot bear it. So this is the adoption, the orphan remedy. Okay, and that to the right side, you see it is more towards sexism because I am a girl, I'm not given equal love. Unwanted and unloved. Okay. Yeah. So these are the characteristic dreams which you'll see in magnesium. So houses, weddings, fruits, feeling of loneliness, no feeling of danger, left behind in the railway platform, pleasant dreams, people's picnics and meetings. So it can be nostalgia as well. It could be bad dreams as well. Okay. This pleasant dreams can go towards ferrum as well. But the loneliness and left behind on the railway platform is more towards characteristic of magnesium. Okay. So the left side you see 
uh, she is left behind on the railway platform. On the right side, you see and dreams of picnics with family members. Okay, a negative and a positive dream. So feeling of loneliness, this you know it. Yeah. So there are times when they do not dream at all, which is a very strange thing because magnesium usually comes out in the form of dreams, the disease. As long as it comes out, they're fine. Okay. So if they don't dream, it's a problem. Okay. So either they could have exhausting dreams or they could have no dreams at all. 